Hi everybody, it's Jeff with uh, Barong. We're back. We apologize, we had some technical difficulties. Um, I'm back here with, again with Ass Assistant Chief Todd uh, from Fond du Lac. So we're going to pick up where we kind of left off. We started talking about the wall behind you. We have a Pro Air AC system in here. Um, Got another upper cabinet, two shelves in it. Um, yeah, we went we went relatively simple with the with the HVAC unit. Um, you know, we haven't uh, seen a real need. We see kind of these varying seasons. You know, he's summer, spring, winter, fall, etc. So it's been efficient. Yeah, yeah, it's been it's been a good system for us. We have a number of departments down in the south that use it. Yeah. Uh, so here we have the uh, you guys went with the ROM roll up system. Yeah. Roll cabinet. Quick, easy access is what you indicated earlier. It is, it is. And and the one thing, again, if, if this vehicle's ever in an accident, we want to make sure that the equipment in there stays in there. Perfect. I see you got some electrical outlets in here as well. Yep. Perfect. How's in your suction in here? Yep, suction unit, uh, Lucas device, light pack 15, medical bags, IV warmer. There's quite a few things that we store in there. Perfect. Yeah. All right, and above here I see we have, uh, we have another glove compartment. Yep, and that's, you know, I mean, obviously one of the first things you do when you get in and out of the way, grab a set of gloves. So, it's a nice handy area for it. We oh, got a timer, a timer there. Timer, yep. Is that for your lights in here? Yep, it it's, off a timer, we activate that, and obviously that's a checkout timer. So basically, you know, we really don't have to do anything to start up the vehicle. You just get in there, give it a twist, and then check up, clean out, whatever, whatever we ever got to do. We got some lights for a little while. And then over here on curbside, we've got uh, a standard bench, but we got the six point harness seats I see here for your staff to be buckled in. Yep. Yeah, exactly. And again, you know, it, it's important to have um, restraint, you know, I mean, that again, safety is number one, um, you know. A little more storage area. Yep, more storage area. And we keep, you know, we keep blankets and we keep a pediatric pack in there. We keep some specialty equipment in there that we don't use every single call. So it's kind of out of the way, um, not in, you know, but still accessible. Perfect. I see you got an upper, upper cap here stuff and I see that you have it set up for each of these and things like that here again with your I'm assuming your IV needles hypodermic needles yep exactly things. usually I mean this area right here is where we got you know most of our IV starts and everything so we got IV needles we got a little bit of clear acrylics plain roll up and then uh, IV solutions drips and everything this is our main IV cabinet with some medications also. yeah it's a pretty ingenious idea they did a great job again we got some MacGyvers and then here you have a unique situation that I've not seen before this is new for me as well I see that you got a deal here that you can extend your uh, area out for the longboard. Go yeah, what it does is it gives us a little additional room. I mean, every now and then we transport multiple patients. Yep. Not often, frequently, but you know, when you've got a six, seven foot patient, which is not usual, but it's nice to be able to have that room and not have to tilt them up or yeah. tilt them down. So we can still secure them well. Yep. See on the right. boat, we have a spot here for some portable portable tanks. Correct. Yep. Easy access. Quick, reach in and grab one when we need one. Yeah. Perfect. All right, uh, we got a clock on the back wall. Yeah, we have a clock and we have a camera back there. Um, we have actually two cameras. We have one, one in the front and then one in the back. Oh yeah, you got um, dual here. And these are non-recorded cameras. Um, the goal of these cameras is really to uh, provide the driver the ability to keep an eye on what's going on in the back. Correct. Obviously safety is most important because if we have one of our medics alone with a patient, the patient becomes combative or violent. Um, Yep. Our driver is going to hear it and is going to be able to look and see what's going and obviously be able to help address the situation. Correct. I see we got indicator uh, uh, lights here on the back for turning and braking as well. Yeah, that's that's one of those nice little things that uh, is really a comfort thing when you're in the back of that ambulance and you see uh, you see the left signal or the right signal go on, you can you anticipate can yourself. Yourself corner. Yep. Yeah, yeah. So, um, CPR this seat. Can, yeah, we got the CPR seat. Obviously, this area is not just CPR, but it's a location for us to actually have additional patient access. We have a nice little cabinet here. It, it was just something we added, and what it does is it's we, we're able to stuff these small animals, stuffed animals for kids. Oh, that's And you awesome. can literally kind of pack a lot of them in there, and they're, they compress down. It's a great and idea. Then, yeah, and so they don't take up a lot of space. It's one other option for us. Just, but you use the space there efficiently. That's yes. Nice. Yeah. Oh, that's pretty awesome to give those animals for the kids. So. Um, Tell me about your experience. Um, you know, well, obviously we talked a little bit earlier about you've been with us for about eight years. Yeah. Uh, how's things been going with North Central? And we thank them for helping work with us. But how's things been with? Working? Yeah, North Central is a is a fantastic uh, dealership to work with. We worked with them many years ago uh, with a different product line, um, but we were fortunate to be able to come back with the Braun line. And uh, Fred and everybody else, Saria, everybody else has been great to work with. 
Um, so it's been a flawless process, and I tell you, we don't have a lot of issues, but when we do, we give them a call and we get great service. So Fred, a phenomenal Fred, job. Fred will take a very good care yep. of you. Yeah, well, again, I want to thank you for your business. No problem. Thank uh, you. Ron really appreciates you, appreciates you and uh, glad to have you part of the family. Yeah, great. We appreciate the product. Great gig. Awesome. Uh, this is Jeff from Braun. Uh, I want to thank everybody. We're at booth 1331. If you want to stop out, please do.